Today we are going to talk about iOS recovery data tool called iMayPhone for Windows and Mac users. It's a simple, easy to use, fast and most of all safe way to recover your lost iOS data. You can choose from four recovery modes and also you can fix various iOS issues with this app. So let's get started. You can download the program or the app from imyphone.com website. You can choose from free version or buy a full version if you want to. The download link will be down in description. And the app supports iPhones, iPads and iPods. It supports iPhones all the way down to iPhone 4 and it supports iOS 11, so it supports the newest iOS. As I said, you can do download the app from uh, iMyPhone uh, website. When you download the app, on the left side you will see four options to choose from and the fifth option is fix your system. Uh, these four recovery modes have different fu functions. So the first mode is called smart recovery mode. It's for the new users or inexperienced users because it's the simplest and easiest way to recover your data. Then we have recover from iOS device. And we will talk about this one later in the video. After that you can choose to recover from your iTunes or iCloud backup depends if you made one before. Instead of uh, recovering your full categories of data, as you can see you can choose from individual item you want to back up to your device. For example, you can choose to recover only messages or photos or texts from WhatsApp or Viber. The last option to choose from is called Fix iOS System. Uh, you can fix problems from black screen, white screen, of that, recovery mode, loop, etc. And there is no risk from losing your iOS data. It only fixes your iOS system, but your data stays infected and safe. Now I'm going to show you how the app works. I'm going to choose recover from iOS device and try to recover uh, files from my iPhone. You need to connect your phone to PC or your Mac and click on start. When you click start you will get this screen and here you can choose which files you want to recover. So for example I don't want to recover my calendar, bookmarks and voices, voice memos, safari history, I don't want to recover my photos or my chats and etc. So choose which files you want to recover. And when you're done, click next and here uh, you will have to wait for your phone to connect to your PC or Mac and if it's necessary you will have to allow access to your phone. And now click scan. And this process takes about 5 to 10 minutes depending on how many files you have and which files you choose to recover from. So I'm going to be back in a moment when everything is done. So now when everything is done uh, it will look something like this. You can choose which files or for my instance call logs I want to recover and if I want to recover everything I can leave it just like this or I can uncheck for instance photos and app videos if I don't want to recover. Also I can choose which call, log, call logs I want to recover. And when you're happy with selected files, go and click on recover. Here you will get the window to choose where you want to save your files or where you want to recover your files. And that's it. You're done with the process of recovering your files from your phone. And as I said, it was fast and easy way to recover your files. So guys, I hope you like my video. If you do, please leave the like button and subscribe to my channel. Down in the description there will be a link for full written article about iMyPhone backup. Please go check it out. There is going to be a giveaway. I'm going to give a few keys for Mac users and a few keys for Windows users. So please stay tuned.